Hello, victorious ones. How are you doing? I hope everyone is having an amazing, golden, victorious day in the Lord. So, victorious ones, I'm here and I'm just keeping my eyes on the Lord, okay? And so, two days ago, I received an email and it says on the email, the Passion Translation, but I didn't open it until this morning. And I want to share it with you because it's confirmation. For those of you who've been following this ministry, you know we pray for prodigals and we've seen them return, okay? And so the title of this email, it says, I hear his whisper, the prodigals will return. And right there, you want to go ahead and praise the Lord. The prodigals will return. If you don't know the story about the prodigal son, go ahead and read it, okay? And so this is what the email says. I'm, I am calling home the sons and daughters who have forgotten me. You will see a waterfall of love and mercy bring my children from afar. I have walled them in. They haven't roamed as far as you expected. They are never outside the boundaries of my love. And I have never left their sides. I know how to woo the hearts I created. They cannot find what they need outside of me. In my mercy, they will be restored with fresh passion to seek me and to know me. Dry your eyes and with a hope-filled heart, look with eyes of faith. The lost ones are coming home. Your delight must be in finding them and loving them back into wholeness and dignity. You will remove loneliness from their hearts. You will see them restored. Even within your family, there will be healing and grace as I recapture hearts and ignite their longings for me. Love them. Forgive completely and you will see the restoration you've prayed for. My will shall be done in their lives. Amen. And the scripture that... Brian Simmons and, you know, their ministry posted is from Luke 15, 4 to 5. And it talks about how there was a hundred lambs and one went astray and the good shepherd went and found the lost sheep. I decree and declare that the prodigals are returning home. This is confirmation to the prayers that we have prayed. Restoration is taking place now on repeat.